Andy Timmons with the That Day Comes. No, That Day Came. CBT lesson for Jason. Andy is amazing. Um, had another student show me him years back. And uh, I found a cover of a guy playing it. I put it in the uploader's name. This dude really did a fabul fabulous job of covering it. Note for note. It's just, that's what I used for the, the model for this. Plus I could see everything he was doing. Tough song. Um, very melodic and beautiful. This is in standard tuning. And section one, zero seconds in, we're starting with this F sharp minor, bar the ninth fret from the A string all the way down, 11D, 11G, 10B. We're going to strum that and then arpeggiate it. We're going to go. And that'll be the G string and then the E and B together twice. So you got. Okay, and that's obviously a hold as we're arpeggiating it. 11D to 10B, hammer to 12. It'll be, and then 9, 10E, so it's to 12B. It's probably how I'd approach it too. Um, you know, I'd have to sit and play with this for a good hour, hour and a half to just get super familiarized with it, but take it in those pieces. So we have two already. Okay, that 12B is going to ring as you do the 11D, um, followed by 10, 12 on the G and B, and then do it again. So it's... And then 11D to 10B hammer 12 to 9E, so it's kind of covers some area, right? to 9B hammer to 10. That's another subgroup. And then 8A, 10D, 10B, and then the D and B string followed by a rest. Sounds like this. Okay, short rest. 10D, you're already there. 10B, pull off to 8. Oops. So you're pull pulling from 10B to 8. 10G, slide to 12, slide to 9. So a lot of technique in this. Once you get there, you'll be going open A, and then 7, 9, D, G, our power chord, and that's a hold, so. Okay, um, from there, short rest, and then go 7G, Slide six, slide seven, hammer nine. And then seven, hammer nine on the B, slide to 10. So you have. And then seven, slide to eight, slide to nine on the high E, so. His attack is just beautifully precise. So that's why I suggest the small groupings of this going over and over, that would be another one in my mind, so. And then 11 G on the D, and then 11, 10, 9, G, B, E, we're back to that F sharp minor. Strum those, and then G and B string. You'll see repeat from the three stars, no, no uh, star. I know that uh, you know what that means because we use them in every CBT lesson. Um, I wasn't sure how to section this, so as I was going through it, I was putting timestamp markers on it and listening for repeats because there wasn't a whole lot of repeats so I had to do s some creative stuff here but it'll make sense in your tabs Jason when you got it so as you're finishing it through the second time you're gonna have 10, 10 on the D 8B and 9G and that's a hold it's a chord it's actually a C major you'll go to 7G vibrato and that'll start this chord 9D 8B 7G so you have this, that happening. So, picture those. Um, from that one, after you do the open A, seven and six D and G, strum those. So you have. 
six hammer seven G to nine G. And then check this out. Beautiful. It's six eight on the E and A, muted D, nine G. You're already gonna be on the nine G, so I think like Satriani and Vai with this this type of thing. Just awesome chordings, man. After you do that, go nine on the G, slide to ten. Oops. To seven G vibrato, so you have. Seven, slide to five, slide to seven. And then hammer 10 G, bend it a whole step. Really cool technique. Then go eight, 10, 11 on the B. Vibrata, so it's. 10 on the B string, half step, pre-bend release. And then eight, 11, and then pre-bend 11, a whole step release to 10 B. A lot of technique, like I said. If you went from that uh, section two at 40 seconds in, you're looking at this. Okay, 8A, 10, slide to 12, to 10D vibrato. Top of page three, 10 hammer 12 on the D, 10 12G bend, to 10B, 11, 13, slide to 17. Sounds like this. Alright, let me try that part again. So we have. Yeah. Then 15, 17, 17, D, G, and B. Then go 17, 18, 15 on the B vibrato. That would be this. 15, slide 13, slide 15, 18, bend. Sounds like this. And then 15, 17, 18 on the high E vibrato. So it's... Pre-bend 17, half step, release. And then go... And this is on the high E. Then go 15, 18. Pre-bend 18, a whole step, release. 17 vibrato. 58 seconds in, 20 on the B, we're gonna bend that. And then go 17 E, 18 B, 17 G, rest. Okay, and then mute the A and D as you sweep into 17 G. So, after the sweep, 1920 DA slide to 15 pull to 12 hit to 13 E here it is again that's the end of that section section 3 a minute 1 in we're going to go 4 on the low E sliding to 9 then go 8 11 A to 9 D Mute the A and D as you slide into 6G, do it like a sweep, slide to 7, rest, slide 6, slide 7, slide 6, so it'll go, or to be. Vibrato, slide to 4, pick 2, rest, 2 slide to 1, and then 4 slide to 6, this is all on the G. Vibrato, so. F sharp minor, uh, 4D, barred second fret on the last three strings, just strum it. That comes in at 107. Okay, 
uh, that is, like I said, the 107 timestamp. 2D slide to 4, 2G hammer 4. And then 2 on the B twice, hammer to the 3rd fret. Here is all of that. 2G slide to 4 vibrato. So you have... And then you'll, as you're vibratoing, you're going to hammer 6, pull 4, slide 2. Okay, and then... Um, slide to 4, hammer 6, pull 4. And then slide to 2. So there's a lot of subtleties in here. Um, 2 hammer 4 on the D, and then 2 4 G, and then 2 B. Sounds like this. And then 1 G twice, slide to 2 vibrato. Here's all of that. So melodic. Top of page 4. 3D, 2G, 4G, half step bend, hold, release, bend, release. Sounds like this. It's a 2G. 6 slide to 7 on the D to 2G. And then go 5 pull 3 on the D string to 2D. Hold it down as you play the open A. So here's that part. Is that ringing? 4G slide to 6. And then pick vibrato slide. 5D slide to 7. Use the middle finger. 6 hammer 7G, pick 9. Right? So. Then go 7, 9, 10 on the B. 7, 8, 9 on the E. So you have this. 123 in, go 9G slide to 11, to 10B, to 12E, whole step bend. And then bend, release, vibrato, so it's 9D slide to 11, and uh, then go 10, 12 on the B, 9, 10 on the E. To 12B, bend, hold, release, pull off to 10, 12, bend, release, bend, release, vibrato. Here's all of that. Nine D slide to 11 again. 10, 12B, nine on the E and B. And then nine, hammer to 10. Then go 10D, this is a hold. Back to 10B, 12B. Half step, bend, release, bend, release, 10 B vibrato. Uh, 10 G slide to 12, bend. Pretty cool, because he's sliding to it and then bending. Don't pick the 12 at all. 10 B, and then back to the G string, 12, 10, 9, vibrato. 12 B, half step, bend, vibrato, so it's... 9G slide to 7, then pick the 7. 10B bend. 7G slide, or pull to 6, vibrato. And then slide. 5D slide to 7. 6 hammer 7 on the G to 9G to 10 twice. Bend release vibrato. 9G twice. Half step bend release. 7 twice. And at that point I started going, these melodies are getting familiar and I went back and backtracked and was able to notate it in your tab. Section 2 one time, section 3, but there's no 107 um, section in that as far as timestamp. Ooh, this is cool too. Love this. It takes a big turn here on the top of page 5. 2 minutes, 10 seconds in, we go 12D, 11G. You can experiment with fingering, I'm going 3rd and 2nd. We're going to go 4 times. Um, but put the ninth fret on the B down as well, because that's coming up. So we have. See, I dropped in the 9B, and then go to the 10B and strum those three strings, but seven times. So it sounds like this. Then we're going to do this 9D, seven on the G and B, four times, to 979, four times, to 9710, seven times. So they follow the same four times, four times, seven times. 
Okay, then we're going to go, same concepts, from the D string down. 12, 11, 10, 9. Now this is eight times. Then drop this high E to the tenth fret and go seven, seven times. So it's. Okay, then we're gonna go 12, 11, 12, D, G, B. We can drop the nine high E on, but don't hit that yet. Back to the four times, four times, and then the tenth fret high E seven times. Sounds like this. Then we go 14, 15, G, B, four times, to 14, 15, 12, four times, and then 14, 15, 14, seven times. So you have two minutes, 30 seconds in, 14, 15, 16 on the G, B, and E string. Go eight times, then drop to the 17 high E, uh, seven times and start to s gradually slow that down. Sounds like this. Okay, and then 234 timestamp. We're going to go 13B to 17E, vibrato. Okay, 